Hi everyone, my name is Stephanie Michaud with Trimble Navigation and I'm here today to talk about our connected farm solution and how you can utilize that in the cloud and also on our on-field platforms with the TMX 2050 display. So what is connected farm? The question has been asked and everyone's talking about data. How do we make that real and what, how do we use it today? And so connected farm is a cloud-based solution to enable growers to make better decisions on the fly in real time. With Connected Farm, it's not just a grower platform, but we've also released a section for advisors as well. So now both agronomists and growers can work together in this platform, on the cloud, wherever you are, and then also on the display in the cab in your tractor. Here's our dashboard, Connected Farm dashboard, which is what you first log into Connected Farm. That's the site you'll see. Um, we have our Doppler radar on the main screen, which shows your weather patterns as they're floating over the area. On the top left, you can also see your typical weather forecast along with commodity prices. We also have fleet where we have different vehicles that are in your local fields that can be tracked and monitored remotely. Uh, rain gauges also show you the rainfall that's fallen in your area, um, how frequently and when and how much, and can show you historical patterns that way. On the right hand side, we can show field task history for coverage data, uh, whether you're harvesting or planting, you can see where you've been through your field and the performance of that vehicle. We also have a section that ties into our Irrigate IQ system, which provides you with a pivot control and visualization as well. So here I am in the Connected Farm field site, which is an area of Connected Farm that is um, primarily for the grower customer. So here I can select from my list of fields that I have available and then the additional, um, the farm and the field within it and look at a specific field. Here I can trace boundaries. I can also look at adding imagery to that data. And so if I click on that, I can actually go through and select a specific crop season and look at the imagery that I purchased from that area. So this imagery is actually a vegetation index proprietary to Trimble called Pure Pixel. So Pure Pixel enables you to have a calibrated scale specific to um, that field that'll show you the vegetation index as well as the chlorophyll index of your field at that particular time. Pure Pixel is unique in that it can provide you with a consistent calibration method and scale rating for your field over the course of many seasons and many years so you can compare apples to apples instead of just what was there in that certain given day. In field I can also view my task history so if I want to look at specific yield maps and look at a harvest cycle I can also do that. Another advantage of Connected Farm Field is that you can also go in and review your task history. So in this example we've harvested uh, specifically this is, a, this is a corn harvesting pattern, so I can pull up that specific task event history and look at how it performed in that field. I can also now, once I have that information, add in things like my soil samples or perhaps some of the rainfall data. Um, also I can purchase imagery to compare and look at how is that field look in, in an imagery perspective versus how my field perform in harvest and I can be able to make better decisions on how I'm going to execute that same task the following year. Now a complement to Connected Farm Field is that we also have Connected Farm Advisor. So this provides the, your agronomists with the similar tools in order to provide recommendations and variable rate application information for the grower on their specific field. So what we're looking at here is the actual soil sampling report that was carried out on the specific field along with all of the different information and parameters obtained from the soil lab. We're able to incorporate that data here onto the advisor section where the agronomist can now go through and create his own specific VRA for that field. The agronomist also has access to all that information available in field, so if there was imagery from either a UAV or pure pixel, plus any rainfall data, they can also capture that here in the in advisor to make the best recommendation possible for the grower. At a later date, the grower can then return to that information and receive their prescription in Connected Farm Field. The other aspect of Connected Farm that's highly useful is our Connected Farm Fleet. So this is a place where you can go and see all your vehicles that are connected via Connected Farm within your organization and your farm and be able to look at how are they performing and what are some of the issues that are going on in, at the time. So if we look at a specific vehicle, we notice that there are some red sections where they were stopped or delayed. 
on the display, you can be prompted with various different um, issues for the reason for your delay, whether it's mechanical failure, maybe the operator didn't know how to proceed, etc. And you can track how productive your operators are remotely in real time. You can list as many vehicles as you want and you can have them from a variety of different makes and models and different colors. Um, it's a brand agnostic system. So now that I've reviewed everything on the Connected Farm on our web portal or the cloud, we can also look at the TMX 2050 display. So everything that I've mentioned with Connected Farm is available on our TMX 2050 display platform, which is on an Android operating system, which gives you great flexibility with operation, connectivity, and also with applications. So those common apps like Scout and Fleet and uh, Field that I mentioned above are all available to you on the TMX display. By being able to work with the TMX 2050 display in your operational application like Precision IQ, you have benefits of having your aerial imagery alongside with your field and your data. You can also toggle from that operational application to go back to irrigate. Perhaps you need to move your pivot in order to continue your operation in a specific field. From there I can also quickly toggle to scout and make sure that I checked that specific boundary that I needed to capture. I can also go into something like the internet if I want to check out my latest hockey scores. All of these things are available to you on the TMX 2050 display. So now that you've learned about Connected Farm on the cloud and also on our display, how do you get your data into the Connected Farm? Well, there's two different options. You can have a Trimble display, which allows you to sync data wirelessly up to the cloud, or you can use your desktop PC with File Sync enabled, which allows you to import files not only from Trimble USB sticks, but also from CNH, so Case, New Holland, and also Agco vehicles using an ISO XML format. So even if you have a competitor display, you can still work with um, our connected farm and have it um, work for you and visualize all these amazing tools at your fingertips. For more information, contact your local Trimble dealer or go visit connectedfarm.com and uh, we're happy to answer any of your questions. This video is brought to you by farms.com.